Hey guys, how's it going? DUJ2 here. And welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. Alright, um... Man, alright, let's, let's talk about a couple of things here. Uh, we are going to 100% talk about this tweet that's right here. Um, because wow. But first of all, I want a huge thanks to our party. Um, we did our, our first coordination today of this event and all of the all of the sets that you see behind me right now those are all just from our level 30 ones um we still have our level 70 ones to go and of course the boosted 96 the only problem with this is we're running out of space <laughs> but it can be done i know some people out there were saying oh it's not possible to coordinate your party with this one and how do you do it because it only lasts for 10 minutes you can't really call them regularly but uh, thanks to DHE and thanks to the coordinators in my party, we were able to come up with a way of doing it. And apart from a couple of little hiccups here and there, you know, that we had along the way trying to figure this out. Uh, yeah, we ended up with a considerable amount of these and none of these are boosted. Uh, and yes, I will be talking about this metal very soon. How I feel about it. Man, look at that multiplier. He has potential. There's some, there's some serious potential there, but... Let's go ahead and talk about, ah, uh, man, okay. All right, we're going to talk about this metal first, and then uh, about this tweet first, and then I'm going to talk about what's going to happen with my jewels and what I'm going to be doing, because as you guys can see, the trio metals leave in two hours, and I'm going to explain why I wanted to pull, why, and, and everything. I'm going to explain everything, because uh, a lot of people have been wondering, don't pull, what are you doing, why are you spending, save, etc, etc. So, we'll talk about that in a second. But first, two very special deals are starting tonight. <sighs> At midnight. The special EX deal will only be here for one day. Draw once to get one EX medal. And draw from the heavy hitter, heavy hitter deal to get powerful single or random target medals. Inc including some high score challenge exclusive. Man, my... I can't speak. Okay, so beyond a shadow of a doubt, without a doubt, I... Okay. The EX deal is a no-brainer pull from it. Like, seriously. I mean, this is probably going to cost 3,000 jewels. Just, it's, it's without a doubt a definite pull for this deal. Because you get an EX. You get a guaranteed EX. When are we ever... When, when in any other situation, circumstance, or anything, are we ever going to get another EX like this? Uh, so I'll be pulling from that. I'll be pulling from that one, guaranteed, 100%. Um, and hopefully I get a good EX. Hopefully I get a good EX. And I was going to say, hopefully I don't get one that I already have. But the only one I have is... Well, I have two Foretellers and uh, the, my Kyrie EX. Those are the only three I have. Um, so pretty much I have some pretty good odds of getting a new one. And hopefully it's a good one. Hopefully it's a good one. I, I know. I know. With my luck, it's going to be one. Okay. Anyway, uh, I, I don't know. I don't know which ones are going to be in this pool. If it's going to be all of the X's. If it's going to be just recent ones. Really, really hoping that it's one that's really going to help me advance my game. Okay. Let's look at the next one. Um, the next one is a heavy hitter deal. So it looks like this is going to be single and random target metals. Uh, and of course we can see in there some recent high score challenge ones. Um, I don't know how long this was going to be around for because it is the day it is today, Monday. I kind of feel like we're going to get maybe three, it's going to be like three days. It's going to be around for three days. Uh, you can also see that it's going to be a five metal deal, which probably means it's going to cost 1500 Now, how do I feel about this? If this is going to be a one a day one, it depends what you're looking for. For me personally, I look at I look at that little pool over there and I see the Donald and the Goofy. I would love to get another chance at rolling some different traits, even actually even I don't know. No, those are the two that I'm looking at right now. Because I already have them. I already have pretty decent traits on them. But it all comes down to traits. It all comes down to the RNG of traits. And that's what I'm going to talk about in a second. 
with regards to the trio medals, with regards to me pulling, what I'm going to do with my metal, with my jewels and everything. But I, I want to wait and see. I want to wait and see. It should be 1500 each. It might be that we're just guaranteed one a day or allowed to pull one a day from these. Uh, it might be unlimited. I don't know. But those medals right there are very good. They're very good. Don't get me wrong. Um, but they are about to be kind of relevant. You know, I mean, with the proper traits, of course. Uh, I mean, that Goofy, I have a Goofy with double cast and with air. And believe me, it is absolutely devastating what it can do. It does some really great things. Um, and it's nice to see that it looks like it's going to be a five metal deal. So it's pretty nice to see that it's not going to be another 3000 jewel pull. Okay, so... Um, <laughs> all right so that i think that's it i think that's all we have uh tweet wise right yes okay so that's all we have tweet wise um of course the ex ex metal I, I can't wait to pull for the ex metal i'm really excited to see what i get but let's talk about this and let me kind of explain why and let me say this right now spoiler alert if you're waiting to see what my decision is no i am not gonna pull i am saving I'm saving my jewels. Um, I might pull from the record keeper one time to get another 7% metal, uh, but I will not be pulling from the EX falling price, uh, from the falling price metal deal. I will not be pulling from right now from the newcomers deal, although I, I really do want to. I want to pull again and try and hopefully get um, another a key art with double cast because I really need that double cast, but I will not be pulling from the trio deal. So let me explain why I wanted to pull. First of all, fantastic metal. Great damage metal, AOE, really great. The first reason why I don't feel like I need to pull or I don't want to pull, sorry, I keep, I'm jumping around here. Uh, so the first reason why I feel like I don't want to pull or I'm not going to pull is because I have Terra. Uh, Terra is gonna give me that 30% boost in my, um, in my guilt and it has the added benefit of having the two down, right? Uh, the two down upright defense for against the enemy. So it all comes down to the Warrior of Light. Um, you guys are probably going to see tomorrow when I'm going to release a video uh, talking about the high score challenge. So uh, let me see if I have it here. Yeah. So the high score challenge, I have not, comp if you guys see, I have not even tried the high score challenge yet because I've been trying to figure out what I want to do this and how I want to do this. I do believe that I can get the 60 million with what I have right now, which is, means I'm going to get two Warriors of Light. But this is the thing. The FFRK banner, you know, pulling from that one is still going to be around for a little bit. If I want to pull from that a couple of times to get a higher percentage, that's great. But I am not going to go in 15 pulls. 30,000 jewels, which means I would have to buy jewels to be able to guarantee myself getting the Aqua Ventus or Terra in the trio banner. And the only reason why I would do that is because of the fact that that little metal right there, this little metal right here, the Warrior of Light metal, is going to be absolutely devastating and is going to have the potential to take you so far in Colosseum that I can't even begin to tell you guys. But there is a huge, gigantic, enormous but here. If you get the right traits. And that's why I'm not going to be pulling. Um, there's no point if you get these two to put them together right away. Because if you get yourself a boosted one, well, you want to put the boosted one in there, right? I mean, you want to put... You want to put the chances for traits into the boosted one. So that's also another thing. Be careful. If you got the 60 million, if you got the two, but if you're doing really good and you think you're going to get the boosted medal, um, probably, you know, hold off. You know, just, just hold off for a second. Wait for it uh, and see what you're going to get. Because, is this, which is a boost? Uh, this, yeah, this is the boosted one. Or this is the boosted one. Um, so, because you're going to get a boosted one. If you're going to be in the top thousand, you're going to get the boosted one. So, it's a good idea to just, you know, hold back and wait for it. But, uh, if you can, if you think you're just going to hit the 60 million, if you think you're not going to get a boosted one, then, of course, it's okay to go ahead and combine these two right away and see what you're going to get. 
But sorry, I messed up here. These are the two. Um, and it's 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 a who knows. It's a potential who knows. The reason why I was thinking of pulling Ford uh, Aqua or Ventus actually um, was because I wanted to guarantee myself that 14%. With that guaranteed 14% and maybe pulling one more time from the FFRK banner, um, I potentially could guarantee myself in the top thousand, which would give me the guaranteed boosted medal and three chances at traits. But that's where it ends. That's where the um, that's where the guarantee ends. I could get myself three two thousand defenses. I can get myself three resist traits, or I could get the holy trinity of all these things, which would be air, ground, and double cast. If you got yourself air, ground, and double cast, or air, ground, and raids, if you want, or triple raids even. But if you got yourself air and ground, ideally air and ground. That metal is going to take you ridiculously far in Coliseum. If you got yourself double cast, equally. You're going to get the four down on the enemy. You're going to be able to go so far. If you got double raids or triple raids, it would become the most awesome raid metal ever. And you could hit yourself a humongous amount of damage. While at the same time, boosting your uh, guilt 30%. You know, your special attack 30% of all metals that come after. Plus, you'd be lowering the enemy's upright defense so that's why i've decided not to pull from these metals um from these banners i wanted to guys i really really wanted to but i would have to buy jewels and that is that my friends is such a slippery slope once you start spending money in this game again it's so easy to continue doing it and believe me i want to and potentially Depending on what I get tonight from the EX Metal deal or potentially what happens in the next month or month and a half up leading up to anniversary, you guys may very well see me pull up, uh, spend money in this game again. Why? Because I got the Terra Metal. Getting that Terra Metal has enabled me to do so much in this game that it is encouraging me to actually spend money in the game. I'm holding back. I'm not doing it yet, but it's encouraging me. Uh, and if you guys want to know which one of these I was going to pull from, more than likely I was going to pull from Aqua, although I really, really would have liked to pull from Terra. And the reason is this. My reason was twofold. Not only do I want the me the boosting medal for the percentage in High Score Challenge, and of course, AoE Amazing Damage medal, putting this one after uh, my Keyblade in the 4th or 5th slot, uh, or even 6th slot, um, after I used Terra, would have been amazing because this metal would have gone in with the two down upright defense on the enemy. But what I was looking for and what I was looking at was right there. Terra has HD Xion and HDP guaranteed. Sorry, well, HDP too, but HD Xion and KH, HD KH to Leon. Those two metals right there, I would have really, really liked to have a chance at getting different traits on. Wonderful metals, absolutely wonderful metals. Uh, could you get these uh, boosted? I don't think you could get those boosted. Um, no, you couldn't get you couldn't get them boosted. Uh, and then the other one was uh, as much as I like Ventus, I really wanted Ventus. Uh, but the problem with Ventus is that Ventus did not have a capacity of giving you a metal that had um, had a, a copy metal. Ideally, ideally, if Antiform had been there. I would have pulled from that one um and you know what actually if they had put antiform there i may have pulled from it i may have actually spent the money now to get it and pull from it uh and secondly or lastly i guess aqua has um hd vanitas uh and or vanitas and it only has a four there's only four metals there so uh, vanitas has a one in four chance and i mean look at those metals Days Riku, Vanita, Zexion, Sora. I mean, all those metals. I already have a great Sora. Uh, my Zexion could use a better traits. My Vanitas and my Bla my Mac my Black Riku is perfect. I mean, he could get double cast too. But I mean, look at those. Look at those metals right there. The guaranteed metals. And in my journey to get the Aqua in 15 pulls, I'm guaranteed I could have gotten plenty of those. And who knows what traits I could have gotten. So. Probably I would have ended up pulling from Aqua just because she has the best chance or from Terra because I, you know, I could use those metals too or better traits on those metals. But yeah, um, 
I decided not to, guys. I've decided not to because as wonderful as these banners are, these guys are going to be back again. Uh, right now, for me, I would have pulled from them just for the percentage in the high score challenge. But again, I still have a couple more days to see what I want to do. I will be running the high score challenge tonight or tomorrow uh, and releasing a video showing you guys what I plan to do and how much I get uh, and just what I can pull off with, uh, with Tara because... She's awesome. <laughs> um, <clears throat> and yeah, so that's all, guys. I'm really looking forward to seeing tonight uh, what this is going to bring us. I'm I'm excited to see what EX metal I get. I really don't think I'll be pulling from the heavy hitter deal just because, well, I don't know, 15, 1,500 jewels. It's tempting. It's tempting. But we're going to see. But anyway, there you guys go. I wanted to do that video kind of explaining because I know a lot of people were like, why are you going to pull? Why are you going to spend money? What, like, you don't need to pull if you already have Terra. And really, the only reason I would have pulled right now was to get the more percentage, to be able to get the Warrior of Light and get the boosted Warrior of Light. But as I said, that's as far as the guarantees go. Everything after that is not guaranteed. I could have got the boosted Warrior of Light. I could have got them all. And then when it came time to, to, to trade it, I would have ended up with a meta with three resist traits. Um, and then what's the point of doing all that when I already have Terra? If I didn't have Terra, we might be talking a whole different ball game here, but I got it. So that's where it is. So thank you very much for watching guys. As always, I am DUJ2. This has been Kingdom Hearts Union Cross talking about this tweet, talking about um, a couple of the reasons why I won't be pulling. Um, and I hope you guys are having a great fun time with this event right now. Again, thank you so much to my party. Uh, I can't believe we got this these many um, this many um, setsers. It's awesome. I'm really looking forward to the next two events, except I gotta get myself some space. Evolve materials. I gotta go get those and start evolving materials. Thanks a lot, guys. I'll see you guys next time. See ya.